Hello everyone. We will continue the topic internal table operations and we already covered append, loop, delete, modify internal table operations and now it's a turn to cover the read table internal table operation. One of the most and by most important and widely used internal table operation. Now, what is read table? Read table word itself is saying it will read the record from the internal table. But the most most important word is it will always read the first matching record from the internal table. If you have so many matching records, but read table will always, always read the first matching record from the internal table. Suppose if I will go for the example, if you see, this is our five records in the internal table. We inserted five records to the internal table. If we read the internal table, what is our internal table? LT underscore data. If we will read this internal table based upon O and O is equal to one. Just understand the requirement. We are reading the internal table. What is our internal table name? LT underscore data. We are reading the internal table based upon O and O is equal to 1. But have you seen for O and O is equal to 1, we have first record. For O and O 1, we have second record. But read table always read the first matching record only. It will check where is the first matching record for O and O is equal to 1. So it will only only consider this particular record, this particular record. It will not go for this second record because read table always, always read the first matching record. Now you can go for read on where condition also. You can go for read on index also. If you remember in case of delete, we deleted based upon their condition. We did it based upon index also. Now, same way we can read based upon their condition or we can say we can read based upon key and we can read based upon index also. But the most, most important thing is Read always return the first matching record. First matching record. Now we will do the practical and guaranteed whenever we will do the practical, it will make more and more sense to you. Now we have five records in the internal table up to this level. Now I will apply read table. Suppose I will comment rest of the logic so that you can see, check the output of read table clearly. I will show you read table now. What a syntax for read table? Read table. It's a keyword itself. Read table. What a name of internal table? LT underscore data. Into. What is the name of work area? LWA underscore data. Now, how, how you can pass a condition? How you can pass a condition in read table? We have the keyword with key. With key. Now, what is the where condition for this read table? We are saying O and O is equal to 1. We are reading the record where O and O is equal to 1. We all know values always pass from right to left. So in this internal table, it will check where O and O is equal to 1. It will check for the first matching record. First matching record where O and O is equal to 1. 
now the most most important part that you will always always use after read table never forget to check size sub c condition we already covered the topic system variables at that time we cover most important system variable size sub rc we already cover one of the most important system variable that is size sub rc whenever something starts with sy it means that is a system variable sap already defined that variable if this variable value is equal to 0 it means our operation is successful we already put so much stress previously on this particular system variable if this system variable value is not equal to 0 it means our operation is unsuccessful now always make a practice that after every read table please please check for size sub rc condition so that we can check are we able to read the fetching record or not suppose i am writing size sub rc equal to 0 then i will go for write statement now what is the work area work area hyphen what is first column o n no what is work area hyphen second column payment for every if there is a and now if read table statement if this read table statement is unsuccessful it is not giving the successful result in the else part we all know in the else part suppose i will display a message unsuccessful i'll show you both the results now if this statement if this statement executed successfully size sub rc will be zero it will display it will display order number and payment mode of the matching record if this read table is unsuccessful it will simply print the message unsuccessful for the best understanding i will show you in debugging mode now i will go to execute we all know desktop 3 is most preferable desktop this is our internal table lt underscore data and if you see work area work area is blank as of now in this internal table what is the where condition for the internal table we already gave with key o n o is equal to 1 right hand side the values are always on the right hand side it will check in this internal table where is the order number 1 where is the do we have a order number 1 yes we have a order number 1 see we have two matching records of order number 1 but read table will always always read the first matching record only only first matching record now if i will go for execute i am doing f6 and have you seen the value of size sub rc is 0 it means we are able to read the record successfully and we are only able to read the first matching record and that first matching record move to what work area if i will show you work area you can see yes we have order number 1 and payment mode c this is the order number 1 and payment mode c it has not read this particular record because it read the first matching record first matching record now size sub rc 0 condition is successful and we are displaying this is the order number 1 and this is the payment mode c done now suppose i am reading a internal table based upon order number 
order number suppose i will go for four now you can see in this internal table there is no order number four so whenever this read table statement will execute size sub r c will be other than c i will show you in that debugging mode now i will go for simply simply execute i am on 44 number line and i am doing f6 and in the internal table there is no order number 4 if you see this internal table this internal table do not have any order number 4 so read table condition is read table statement return which result unsuccessful result and what is the value of size sub r c 4 size sub r c 4 means other than 0 so system will simply go to which part else part and you can see what is the result now unsuccessful so this is golden rule yes read table always always return the first matching record first matching record only yes if it is able to read the first matching record size sub r c 0 if it is not able to read size sub r c will be other than 0 never forgot to use size sub r c now this read table this read table we read based upon the where condition yes how we give the where condition using with keyword using with key i'll say keyword now i will go for read table based upon index we can read a particular record based upon index yes we all know read table return the first matching record so i can read a particular record based upon index also suppose i am writing read table what is internal table lt data into suppose i am writing lwa data i am writing index 4 it means whatever the record which is present at index 4 in this internal table it will move to which particular work area lwa data and have you seen we are reading a particular record only we are reading a single record which is on which particular index fourth index now same way i will write if size sub r c equal to zero if it is able to read now for every if there is a and if i'll check the syntax and i will activate now i will show you the result of this now i'll put a breakpoint we have five records in the internal table internal table and which record which record is present on index 4 order number 2 and payment mode b now we are reading a particular record which is present on which index index 4 i am going for f6 and you can see but the value of size sub rc 0 0 0 means successful it means fourth record from the internal table move to which particular work area lwa data if you see the work area the order number is 2 and the payment mode is d and what is the record which is present on index 4 i'll just wait i think system is hanged now it's working now which record is present on index 4 order number 2 and payment mode is d I'll go to desktop 3 and now I'm executing. So you can see order number 2 and payment mode is D. So we read a record on particular index also. Now one more scenario I will take so that topic will make more more sense to you. Now I'm going for read table again. Read table, internal table into work area with key suppose this time 
एम पासिंग की पेमेंट मोड इज इक्वल टू सी सपोज आई गो फॉर पेमेंट मोड इज इक्वल टू डी नाउ आई विल राइट इफ साइज सब आर सी इक्वल टू जीरो विल गो फॉर राइट स्टेट so that you can understand fully how it is always always reading the first matching record now our read table we are reading the internal table what is the where condition payment mode is equal to d now if you see for the first record payment mode is c for the second record payment mode is d for the third record payment mode is c for the fourth record payment mode is d for the fifth record payment mode is c for second and fourth record for second and fourth record the payment mode is d but read table always read the first matching record whenever it will find the first matching record it will read after that it will not read the next record so it will simply simply read the record which is available on which particular index second index because on the second index itself it found the payment mode as d if i will show you i am going for debugging mode you can see read table this is our internal table it has five records and what is the where condition payment mode is equal to d so it will read and here itself it will find payment mode is equal to d so now it will not go to this record because read table always return the first matching record always read the first matching record now if i will do f6 you can see it read the first matching record and which record went to work area 1 and d 1 and d and if you see which record 1 and d because here itself we have the first matching record where payment mode is d size sub r c 0 and now it is displaying you can see 1 and d so what we studied in this particular video we cover one of the most important and widely used internal table operation that is read table important read table always always read the first matching record after that it will not read after that it will not read the next matching records never never forgot to use size sub r c after the read table if it is able to find the first matching record size sub r c will be 0 if it is not able to find the first matching record size sub r c will be other than 0 you can read based upon key also you can read based upon index also key means you are passing the where condition so that's it in this video in the next video we will go for more internal table operations thank you